keep watching Celebrity Info News. Breaking news. Vicky Richards. She was a British, Trinidadian actress. Richards moved to England at the age of eight and acted in The Love Factor, 1969, London Line, 1971, and Black Snake, 1973. She worked at the Carib Theater. She took part in the television show Building Your Dreams. One, after retiring, Richards relocated to Trinidad and Tobago in 2004 and lived in Valsing. She was born on December 29, 1949 in Trinidad. She died on March 6, 2024. Cause of death not known. She died at the age of 74. Steve Lawrence. He was an American singer, comedian, and actor, best known as a member of a duo with his wife, Adie Gorm, billed as Steve and Adie, and for his performance as Maury Sline, the manager and friend of the main characters in The Blues Brothers. Steve and Adie first appeared together as regulars on Tonight starring Steve Allen in 1954 and continued performing as a duo until Gorm's retirement in 2009. Lawrence was born as Sidney Leibovitz to Jewish parents in the borough of Brooklyn in New York City. His father, Max, was a cantor at the Brooklyn synagogue Beth Shalom Tomchi Harov. His mother, Helen, was a homemaker. He attended Thomas Jefferson High School. During his high school years, Lawrence earned some money after school singing for songwriters in the Brill Building. Lawrence and Gore married on December 29, 1957, at the El Rancho Vegas in Las Vegas, Nevada. They had two sons together. David Nessim Lawrence, born in 1960, is an ASCAP award-winning composer who wrote the score for High School Musical and Michael Robert Lawrence, 1962 to 1986, who died suddenly from ventricular fibrillation resulting from an undiagnosed heart condition at the age of 23. Michael was an assistant editor for a television show at the time of his death and was apparently healthy despite a previous diagnosis of slight arrhythmia. Gorm and Lawrence were in Atlanta, Georgia, at the time of Michael's death, having performed at the Fox Theater the night before. Upon learning of the death, family friend Frank Sinatra sent his private plane to fly the couple to New York to meet David, who was attending school at the time. Following their son's death, Gorm and Lawrence took a year off before touring again. A.D. Gorm died on August 10, 2013, at age 84 after a brief, undisclosed illness. In June 2019, following public speculation about his health, Lawrence announced that he was in the early stages of Alzheimer's disease and that treatment to slow its progression had so far been successful. He was born on July 8, 1935 in United States. He died on March 7, 2024. Cause of death illness. He died at the age of 88. Brian Nestand. He was an American consultant and politician who was a Republican California State Assemblyman representing the 42nd District. Brian Nestand was born in Newport Beach, California on January 10, 1964. He grew up in a political family. His father, Bruce Nestand, was a state legislator and Orange County supervisor during the 1970s and 1980s. Nestand graduated from Canyon High School in Anaheim in 1982. Nestand earned his Bachelor of Arts in Political Science from Cal State Fullerton in 1991. Immediately after graduating from college, Nestand obtained a job as deputy campaign manager of the successful congressional campaign of Michael Huffington in Santa Barbara County. In 1994, Nestand managed the successful congressional campaign of then Palm Springs Mayor Sonny Bono. Nestand went to work in Bono's office as chief of staff until Bono's death in early 1998. Bono's widow, Mary Bono Mack, was elected to succeed Sonny, and Neston served as her chief of staff from 1998 until 2000. In 2000, Neston built a government affairs consulting business named Neston and Associates, which was headquartered in Palm Desert. He represented a variety of clients working on issues involving alternative energy, healthcare, telecommunications, as well as on other projects and issues in Riverside County. He was born on January 10th, 1964 in United States. He died on March 6th, 2024. Cause of death not known. 
He died at the age of 60. Jim Roddy. He was a Pennsylvania businessman and politician best known as the former and first chief executive of Allegheny County, Pennsylvania from 2000 to 2004. He was a Republican and was the chair of the Republican Committee of Allegheny County from 2005 until 2016. Roddy was originally from Asheville, North Carolina. He graduated from Texas Christian University in Fort Worth, Texas with a degree in speech. He was a former United States Marine Corps captain and moved to Pittsburgh in 1979. Roddy grew to become a champion speedster in track and field, a dedicated Marine, a close associate of Ted Turner's, a business success in his own right, an intrepid racer of sailboats, and a wit, humorist, and raconteur without peer in Pittsburgh. According to Pittsburgh Quarterly, he was born on 1933 in United States. He died on March 7, 2024. Cause of death, natural causes. He died at the age of 91. John Kuma. He was a Ghanaian politician, entrepreneur, preacher, and a lawyer. He served as the chief executive officer of the National Entrepreneurship and Innovation Program, NEP, until elected as the member of parliament for the Ajisu constituency in the 2020 Ghanaian general election on the ticket New Patriotic Party, NPP. John was born on August 4, 1978. He hailed from Ajisu Odaho, a farming community in the Ajisu municipality in the Ashanti region of Ghana. John Kuma attended Apoku Ware School, secondary education, in Kumasi. He continued to the University of Ghana, Lagan, in 1997 and was awarded a Bachelor of Arts in Economics with Philosophy. In the year 2009, he was awarded an MBA, Finance from Gimpa. He also had a degree in law, LLB, from the University of Ghana and a professional law degree, BL, from the Ghana School of Law. He also had his postgraduate diploma in applied business research from the Nobel International Business School in 2019. In November 2020, John Ampanchua Kuma received a doctorate in business innovation from the Swiss Business School in Switzerland. He also had a master's in applied research, business innovation, from the same institution. He was born on August 4, 1978 in Ghana. He died on March 7, 2024. Cause of death illness. He died at the age of 45. Lucas Samaras. He was a Greek-born American artist. Samaras participated in Caprao's happenings and posed for Siegel's plaster sculptures. Claes Oldenburg, in whose happenings he also participated, later referred to Samaras as one of the New Jersey School, which also included Caprao, Siegel, George Brecht, Robert Whitman, Robert Watts, Jeffrey Hendricks, and Roy Lichtenstein. Samaras previously worked in painting, sculpture, and performance art before beginning work in photography. He subsequently constructed room environments that contained elements from his own personal history. His auto-interviews were a series of text works that were self-investigatory interviews. The primary subject of his photographic work is his own self-image, generally distorted and mutilated. He has worked with multimedia collages and by manipulating the wet dyes in Polaroid photographic film to create what he calls photo transformations. Samaras represented Greece at the 53rd International Art Exhibition, the Venice Biennale, June 7 to November 22, 2009, with the multi-installation Paraxena in the Greek Pavilion in the Giardini. Samaras was the subject of several portraits by Chuck Close in media including painting, daguerreotype, and tapestry. Samaras sculpture Stiff Box 12 has been outside the University of Michigan Museum of Art since 1997. He was born on September 14, 1936. He died on March 7, 2024 in United States. Cause of death complications. He died at the age of 87. Morton Povman. He was a Democratic member of the New York City Council, representing the 15th District and later the 24th District of Queens, which included Forest Hills, Rigo Park, Kew Gardens, Briarwood, Kew Gardens Hills, and Fresh Meadows. He served in this position from 1971 until his retirement due to term limits in 2001, making him the longest-serving councilman in the history of the city council. 
Born in Brooklyn to Russian Jewish immigrants, he graduated first in his class from Brooklyn Law School in 1955 and was editor-in-chief of the Law Review. He then founded a law office in Forest Hills. Prior to public office, Pavman served as legal counsel to State Assembly Majority Leader Moses M. Weinstein. Pavman married Sandra Arco in 1958. He had two sons, both of whom went on to practice law in New York State, and five grandchildren. He was born on January 13, 1931 in United States. He died on March 5, 2024. Cause of death cancer. He died at the age of 93.